Hello everybody, this is Greg29407, back with another episode of City of Heroes. I'm on Termite, my plant nature controller, and we are about ready to do an ITF, Imperius Task Force. Uh, we're over here in, in Simarora. As you can see from over here, we've got two teams that are forming up. Uh, most of us are in the same uh, super group, and then we've, uh, we've filled in with a few extra players who are here wanting to, to join up with the team and, and do some fighting. So we're going to get started in just a couple minutes. This is uh, the ITF. Uh, there are four missions in this, uh, and I've done this once before. This is uh, one that, that people do a lot. It gets uh, used quite a bit, uh, quite often, and uh, it's very popular, but I think I've only done it one time. Um, the last mission in particular is pretty tough, so we'll see how that goes. And uh, I am at level 48. We're playing a level 49 uh, mission right now. We have several in our super group. They're now hit level 50. They've maxed out, so it's doing pretty well. And uh, we're just getting everything... Uh, ready getting started in a few minutes and i will be right back when we get started on the first mission be right back okay we have gotten started here i'm going to switch back over to the team level and uh to consult the oracle okay there's four main missions here this one uh we're going to consult an oracle then i think we're going to have to save some uh some victims of kidnapping or something let's see where we go with this We did a bit of this uh, after one of our regular group get-togethers. We meet every Tuesday night, and uh, we did this uh, one late one evening, and uh, it was pretty tough. I didn't know what we were doing, so I had to read up on it a little bit. All right, we're all in here. Consult the Oracle and 10 Sybils to rescue. Okay. Go ahead and get my fly trap out. I've got all my powers turned on. We'll see how, how long this lasts. <laughs> I'm trying. Oh boy! There you go. All right. Let's uh, do wild growth. Life giving spores. I turn on my entangling aura. I'm just gonna try and think a little slower than I normally do. Not so much with my um, my roots. Seems to get me in a bit of trouble. It's a little bit loud. Seems a little loud. Seems a little loud. Yeah, we're gonna fight our way through uh, these hallways, all these centurions and everything. I'm going to put this on hold until we get uh, towards where all the, the ten Sybils are. I think they're in a, an outdoor area, I believe. So I'll put this on hold with you right back. I think this is one of the Sybils right here. Yeah, the Sybils are in these uh, tunnels with us, and we've saved one there. There's another one here, so I guess they're all in here with us. Sure, this lady's not coming with us though for some reason. So let's go ahead and lay them tangling uh not giving spores down here. We've got a blaster to help us out. Okay, we've got six uh, 
Okay, we got uh, three rescued. Oops. Forget to turn off the, the uh, life giving spores. Oh, yeah, let me turn on the uh, airing creatures, too. So I am now going to put this on hold until we get uh, all the other siblings rescued, and I'll be right back. Okay, we just freed the last of the sibyls, and we need to consult the oracle. Let's see what our map looks like here. We've covered quite a bit of ground here. They're all in these tunnels. Okay, so here's some kind of doorway. Wait a minute. Oh, this is back the way we came. That was a different, no, it was a different entrance. Okay. I think. Look at the boat we came in. I don't know. What are we doing? What are we doing? We go back in? <laughs> okay, I don't know where we're going. Where's everybody? Okay, well, we got zapped over, over to here, wherever this is. Is the boat down there? No, I don't know. Let's see where we're at now. Yeah, look at the same spot. Maybe a higher up on the. Maybe went up a higher level. I don't know. Oops, I turn that okay. I'm trying to get the same guy. There's certainly a lot of grunting. These uh, these some roaring bad guys uh, do grunt quite a bit. <laughs> I got too much of this. Let's get this in, uh, clear a little few of these stacks. Okay. down. Wild growth on the team. Right, let's lay waste to some of these guys. These are all fairly high level, so I'm, uh, I, I am missing quite a bit more than I normally do. The good news is I've got, look at my uh, my smashing resistance is super high because I've got, I do have this on, my temporary invulnerability. And uh, so it's staying about 69%, and it does actually go higher when some of the other teammates are around. So it's really strong. The range defense is not high. But... Let's get this thing started here. We'll lay down some carrying creepers. All about the damage. You can see the orange numbers coming off. This is his character. Been a tour. I'm going to go.
go ahead and put me out here. Oh! <laughs> well, that didn't do me any good. Great. Alright. And I'm dead again. Too much, too much. I want to get the uh, crowd a little away from me before I try this again. This is go. Please don't kill me, please don't kill me, please don't kill me, please don't kill me, please don't kill me. I don't think we know what we're doing. I know I didn't, but I think no one else did what they were doing either. <laughs> Jeez. All right. Look at these guys. Holy moly, there's a bunch of these dudes. Man, I'm supposed to fight all these guys. So do we go to the hospital or uh, do we go to the base? This is just mission number one. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. All right, let's turn everything back on again. Wow. There sure are a lot of enemies in there. They're all pretty big, and they're all purple, which I don't think is a very good uh, way for us to play the mission. <laughs> Holy moly, let's do a little lower level. All right, now how do I get to where they, we were? Is it, is it up here? No, it's not out there. I guess you do have to go through the... Through the uh, inside okay so where's the entrance or the exit let's see here what's going on here what are these enemies who are these guys Oh, for crying out loud, what are they doing down here? No! This stinks. All right, I'm going to put this on hold until we get a better handle on what we're doing here, because I don't think this is going to work otherwise. Uh, so I'm going to put this on hold, and we'll figure out what we're going to do, and I'll be right back. Okay, round three on this. It looks like they're a little bit better spread out. We're going to try and take them one at a time. Slowly work our way through. But two at a time. So 
of wood. There's a bunch of up there. Right, let's put this down. They don't keep spawning out in the outdoor area. <laughs> Jeez Louise. Wow. See where we're trying to get to here. All right. I think that's the exit up here. bit better. Let's not get too cocky yet, though. <sighs> Boy, I hope they don't breed those things again. Creepers. All right, I'm not doing much damage. To that. Put the mushrooms on their head over here. kind of damage whatsoever. The carrying creepers are doing pretty good. I don't think I'm doing much damage though. A little bit. This guy's maxed out. And, uh, wild growth. Wild growth? No, uh, it's not wild growth. Yeah, my, uh, I'm putting it on this, uh, this hold and it's not holding anybody. It is not holding anybody. Doing some minor damage to this guy. Not a whole lot. And he's getting healed up, so there's a healer in here somewhere. Find the healer. I am just. Ugh. This is ugly. I'm not doing much good at all here. The 
entangling thing is not entangling anybody, and uh, you can't hold him either. Yeah, I got a little, little something there. Oh, my Venus flytrap is gone. Yeah. Yeah, this guy's just standing here. <laughs> I'm not doing nothing. There we go. I got some, some double-digit numbers against him. There we are. I was actually approaching the teens on damage that time. Yay! Oh. We're done. How we're done. I guess someone consulted the Oracle. Back down. He's back down. Oh, never leave it. Great. Boy, oh boy, that was a tough start to this. This is that was mission number one. Holy smokes! All right, that was mission number one. Now what we have to do is uh, take out the shadow cysts. Destroy. Okay, destroy the shadow cysts. Let's see what this is all about. I think this is like the. I've done some uh, some just random radio missions in here on um, Tiffany St. Ange, where we had to fight those uh, those shadow cyst things in some caves, and they are tough. Is the over here? They are pretty tough to fight. And they were they kept breeding, too, or, or replicating or something. So I had a bunch of them to fight, and I've had to pick them off one by one. Let's see what this is all about. All righty. Oh, my spirit tree followed me from the last mission. Look at that. You just popped right on up there. <laughs> okay. Well, we don't need it at the front door, but that's okay. I guess it's on a timer, and, and as long as you're in a mission, it'll pop back up. Ooh, got some magic put on me. Some wild growth again. Put back on my entangling aura. These guys are a little bit more reasonable level. Reds and yellows, good. Still deflecting my attacks, but at least I have a better chance of hitting them. Guys, I got to a little damage to. All right, good. Ten shadow sisters are what we have to fight. Ten of these guys. Oops.
Oh, there's more of those guys. Let's get this down right here. They're red at least, rather than purple. Kind of work our way through slowly. Should be in okay shape. There's a shadow sis. All right, shadow sis crystal. There we go. I'm just trying to go. There we go. Okay. So I got to put this in hold while we go through this, and I'll be back in a few minutes. Here's something good to know: when those shadow sis, uh, when you destroy them, they will blow up and they will stun the heck out of you and kill your uh, fly traps. So you had a very dangerous. We got a Cyclops in here, the lead boss. He's kind of popped up, so yeah, I was standing right next to one of those shadows, this, and uh, it went off. Put mushroom on his head. Do that, okay. There's another Cyclops. I'm gonna put a mushroom on him. Put down my life giving spores here. I'm going to do overgrowth, which overgrowth is going to give it plus damage to hit, endurance discount, and plus five boom to everybody. That should help out. He's shaking pretty good. <laughs> well, these guys, the mushrooms have spread pretty well. All these guys get the mushrooms on them now. Oh boy. Okay. I'm gonna keep going with on this, and uh, as we wait, we've only done the two shadow assists so far, so there's quite a few more to go. And I'll be back when we get closer to the end. Okay, there's the last Shadow Sith Crystal. Get away from it. There we go. And I, I think I've lost like 12 fly, uh, fly traps in this thing. <laughs> the fly trap is always right in the middle of everything. Are, are we leaving? I think we are leaving. All right. That was into mission two. All right, so next, what we need to do, we're going to have to uh, stop Romulus. He's the main villain, the main bad guy. And after that, we're going to have to uh, protect the uh, Super Aurora City from Romulus. Romulus is going to survive this mission, and then he's going to make a final attack at the end. I think we have to uh, fight all of the people in, all, in this uh, castle over there. All right, but this one, I'm not, I don't remember what this was all about. Let's see. Romulus is rallying his troops to the full, for a full assault on your time. Oh, oh that's right. The, what they're going to do is Romulus wants to attack our present day time and uh, kidnap like Positron and uh, um, the main bad guy and, and bring him back this time and, and take over the world or something. So we're trying to stop him from doing that. So we're going to go through these, these uh, this, this uh, walkway through the mountains and stuff and just keep fighting. It's going to be like kind of a gut it out. We had to kill five generals. The Romulus Phalanx, defeat Romulus, and then a hundred Cimarron traitors. This is going to be quite the mission. Oops. There, and bring up my poor fly trap. I don't think I've ever gone through so many fly traps in one short time. Oh, 
bring all these guys over here before we get our patch. Well, our safety patch. Okay, so that's 14 Civil War traders there. Surgeon guy somewhere out there. Ah, you see that my uh, entangling or I got this guy. to fight you know here's some guys walking around over here there's a the path goes up this way too we have to cross that bridge eventually and go over that way there's another group of guys who are going to walk into our, our trap Go ahead and put this on the hold uh, until we get to at least some of the generals across that bridge. We got to basically just kind of work our way all the way around this mountain uh, across the bridge to uh, the civilization where, where Romney is waiting. Fight him in the, on his home turf. Let's see if we can spot that first. Yeah, there's the bridge. Under over this bridge, and then through those columns, and then up to the road some more is where his, uh, his, his castle or, or whatever it is. Uh, his, his home base is that we're going to have to get to. So I can put on hold for right now, and we'll be right back. All right, these guys look pretty tough. We're getting uh, farther and further up here. we got a lot of Cyclopses, a lot of uh, a lot of everything. Holy moly. Okay, let's put this down here. I'm going to lay down a spirit tree right over here as well. Put mushroom on this guy's head. So we've gotten three of the generals killed, and uh, we've killed all the traitor guys. I'm crazy at it. We still have to kill the Romulus Phalanx, the two generals, and the other two generals himself. This is quite the battle. He does not want to go down easily. They're all elite bosses too, so there's a bunch of elite bosses in here. <laughs> okay. Engineers and uh, surgeons out here. Gonna put mushroom on this guy. Yeah, oh, he just died. Well, anyone coming over here, we'll get the mushroom for a little bit anyway. Surgeon in here somewhere that's healing this guy up. Got him. Holy smokes, look at all those guys up there. Yikes, there's a lot of guys in this mission. I don't know how many more we got to go. All right, so I'm going to put this on hold until we get close to Romulus. We got only one general left in his phalanx. When we get close to Romulus, I'll be right back. All right, we made it through here. We made it to the top of this hill. Look at this thing. Look at this giant robot guy. This is the, oh, the fifth column. The fifth column have come back in time, and they're back here. There's some kind of uh, mystic going on here. 
So apparently the fifth column is going to help Romulus come to the uh, our present day and do all sorts of bad stuff. I guess they're going to get some kind of uh, special compensation for that. They're going to fight werewolves and stuff. Boy, oh boy, I don't remember any of this. There's a big robot. Where's everybody? Where is everybody? Ah. There's another robot over there. Jump at you, listen about they're all over the place. See that thing. Oh, it's a gun of some type. Trap is almost dead, and the black trap is dead. Oops. <laughs> oh well. Here we go again. Oh, this story is crazy. Holy cow, look at all those guys up there. Man. fighting robots in, in ancient Greece. The boss man. Oh, there's a, that's a, that's the main guy. That's the main guy. Romulus Augustus. All right, he's the, he's the big bad here. I got to put overgrowth on everybody. Wild growth. Put my life giving, saving spores down. Beat the unit one out of this guy. Carrying creepers on this guy too. We got lots of creepers going on him. All right. Oh boy. So this this one power is explosive enzyme. This this what you get at level one. I like that power. It seems to do a pretty good job. It helps debuff the guy. It, it does, it's not like massive, but it, it does help. So I'm gonna put the mushrooms on this on his head now. Got him. Got him. He's got some uh, helpers still. I'm not sure how the robots tie in with this. Okay. They got a big base here. That's where the fifth column and all their, uh, their stuff. 
one general and his phalanx. A bunch of guys over there. Oh, there's, uh, there's something glowing over there, too. Start over here. Oops, should turn this off. We don't have to fight everybody on here. Okay, he's another uh, Archville. Oh, he's an Archville. All right. Let me uh, spread the wild growth. Put mushrooms on his head. Put down the uh, life-saving spores. So he's, this is the, the guy who's the head of the fifth power. So he fought the, the main Simul Warren bad guy, and they were fighting his helper. Main fifth column bad guy. Alright. What else we got? Just the Romulus Phalanx. Maybe this is it. You're doing damage, you don't even notice it. Right. Okay, where to next? Another robot. Holy moly, look at this. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, that's his phalanx control. Oh, that's what we got to destroy. I'm going to put my life saving spores right in the middle of here. But I get the feeling when this thing goes down, these robots are going to come to life. I do remember this part. I remember we came down here and we fought these guys, and then that was it. I never looked right there. I was never up on this upper level. I never even saw those robots there. Yeah, we came in. Uh, I think I got. Uh, yeah, we came this way. We, uh, I got um, teleported. Oh, here comes. Yeah, here their robots are coming to life now. Yeah, Yeah, that's right. I remember this thing and these robots came alive. We had to fight these guys, and that was kind of it. Because all the main bats, the uh, Romulus and the other guy came down here. I never even saw these robot things up here. Those are really impressive. Those are cool ones. I like that. Okay. So every time you get the... Uh, this control box down somewhat, the more robots come to life. Look at this. Oh, boy. Are you doing damage to this thing? Yeah, it's a damage to this thing. I'm just... 
<laughs> oh boy. Yikes. Got him. Holy smokes. <laughs> Sorry about that. That was the end of mission three. All right. Now next we find out that uh, Romulus did not die. He survived somehow. And uh, now, he got, now he's going to try and uh, we got to re help reclaim some Aurora. Yeah, this is one of these. Um, this is the task force that a lot of people do the um, speed runs on. They race through here really fast. I have no idea in the world how that can possibly be. This is taking a really long time. And it seems really complicated. Okay, I remember doing this. There are like 300 enemies we gotta fight. Plus, yeah, defeat Romulus and his minions and 300 traitors to defeat. So you got the guys over here, all along this way, all over there, and then there's some areas back there they can be in as well. Wild growth, and I'm also gonna do overgrowth. Hey, and I leveled up. Level 49. I start off just at 48. So at this point, I have uh, moved on an entire level. Oh, we have a helper here. This is uh, a curious. Repeat. So we've got a lot of guys to fight. We don't have to keep this. So what I'm going to do is put this on hold until we get a little closer to the end, and I'll be right back. Okay, this is looking like the big final uh, area. A bunch of bad guys in here. I see a glowy thing over there too. Got a mixture of uh, the fifth column and the ancient Romans, the Greeks. Cutscene. Master, I have failed you. The champions wield the power of the gods. Perhaps they do, Romulus. Oh, that's Romulus, okay. But I will make you stronger than even the gods themselves. How is that? I will show you. Oh, the dark gods. Okay, now, oh boy. So now he's like Nictus. Champion shall be a feast laid before me. 
his costume even changed too. <laughs> so apparently it's a uh, it's an evil demon and a tailor. And there is some kind of strategy that we need to do here, or, or decide to do or not do. When we, when we get through all these jokes. So we got 36 more craters to destroy here. He's going to have a couple of these glowing things that are going to be guarding him. One is a helps you fight and one of them is healed. And there's going to be a question of are we going to just kind of separate them out, try and, and separate them out, or are we just going to like fight right through them? It's two different strategies you can use. I'm not, I, the one I did before, we just fought right through them. Uh, I'm, doing, I'm just going, all right, let's, let's go for it. Sounds good to me. I'm giving scores. Yeah, apparently they're, they're really, uh, he's going to have a couple of these Nictus things that are helping him. And there's a, a trick you can like, use a tanker or a blue to, to pull one of them away and fight them. The other way is just go in there and fight. Just kill everybody, which I think is what we're going to do. It's a little bit easier. I might say it's easier in terms of solution, but easier to understand. <laughs> Just kill everything. <laughs> okay, well, this is a uh, general sar or something, okay? Wild growth, overgrowth. Oh, well, that guy went down pretty good, all right? There's Romulus, there's Nictus Essence, and Nictus Essence. So those are the ones you sometimes want to separate out. Okay, I think I'm going to stay on here for a minute. Oh, we're going to try and draw some of these guys off of here. So we fight, fight the main bad guy. You want to have a bunch of helpers. Well, here's our, uh, here's the uh, Imperius, the good guy. Okay. Going to be boss down. We have vampires and werewolves for no apparent reason. They're just here, <laughs> part of the fifth column, so. Okay, I'm gonna take the, that back up. Oh, I guess they're bringing him down here, oh. Heck, I shouldn't have taken that up. I'm going to put this right here. And he ran over to the side. Great. <laughs> oh, boy. Ooh, ooh, he looks hard. Okay. I'll fly trap back. Okay, so what are we fighting? Ooh, I'm dead. Way down there. Spirit tree. We're supposed to fight this essence thing? I don't seem to be doing any damage to it. How about this guy? I'm gonna fight this guy. Oh, I don't think this is working very well. 
Run, 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 run. Okay. Alright. More powers. Guys, closer to death at least. Turn this off. Oh, we got no, we got health. Great. guys for any damage at all. Oh, he's back to life again. Oh, no. What? Okay. Life giving spores. Mushroom on his head. All growth. Overgrowth. Spirit tree. Folks. 
stack of full power against this. Carrying creatures. I'm gonna put this on hold because it's kind of boring to be honest with you. I'm gonna put this on hold until we get him. You know, I think I had to kill him maybe three times or something. I don't know. Uh, be right back. Okay, we're back. Uh, this is his fourth life now. We killed him uh, a couple more times. That is it. Is that it? That is it. It took us an hour and 50 minutes to do that. It seemed like about five hours. Um, let's see. Uh, I'm going to take merit for this. Holy cow, that was a long mission. It was hard. Um, we died a bunch of times. And, um, ooh, boy. Okay, so that was the ITF. I've heard about this I've heard about this story arc, or this task force, many, many times. Everyone's always doing it. They do multiple times a night. I can't imagine that. Thanks. Okay. Um, so I was going to do it. It uh, looks like, let's see, he died four times. This is not ten like the one last one. So I guess he can die more than four times. I guess it depends. Um, I, I don't know what triggers it. Don't know. So we're, getting some, we're getting some pictures taken. Um, all right, so that's going to do it for us. Uh, how many things did we get here? We got uh, 26 reward merits. 26, that's it? Uh, okay. Uh, that was hard. That was really hard, and that uh, an hour and 50 minutes, it seemed like it was a lot longer than that. Anyway, uh, that's going to do it for us. That is the Imperius Task Force, or ITF, uh, very famous one. So um, that is it. Until next time, this is Greg29407 along with Termite saying sayonara. We will see you next time.